This video is going to show you how to do a review for one of your staff. So to get to this, you're going to go to performance and under review status, you will see the review that you need to do. You can see that the employee, Gavin Watson, has completed the self appraisal, self review. And for you to do your portion of the review, you're going to click manager and supervisor 2019. So you're going to click the blue link and here you could start doing your review. So you can read this top section on the left here is the navigation toolbar and let's go down to quality. You can see what the employee put on their self appraisal self review here and then you can put your comments here if you would like. Please know that I am just doing a test, so I'm going to go through this very quickly. But you can read the review item, and then your rating, and then again the comments down here from the employee. So the self-review mirrors this review. So I'm just going to go down quickly and put in some items. Mm. Perfect. So then when you're done, you're just going to click next in the bottom right hand corner. And then we're on to the second part of the review. So again, you're just going to rate the items. Again, I'm just doing a test. When you're done, click next in the bottom right hand corner. If you have uh, requested any peer feedback, they will appear here and you can add it into the review. Uh, this employee does not have any, but if there is, this is where it will appear. Click next in the bottom right hand corner. This will show all of the impressions this employee has. Please note that you can change the date range here if you're just trying to get the last quarter or anything like that. And to include a impression in the review, you just need to tick the box next to the review to add it into the review. So you might want to do ones that um, really obtained their performance. So when you're done, scroll all the way to the bottom and press next on the bottom right hand corner. And then this will come to the summary page. So you can see the summary of everything there. And here at the top, um, there's two options. So make visible to employee. When you're done, you'll click this and then this will go back on the employee so they can view and sign it and put any comments. If you want to reopen to the employee, so if you want them to change anything on their self review, you would click reopen employee. But the majority of people would just click make visible to employees. When you click that, then the employee will go in, look at their review and put any comments and complete it. And then it will come back to you for the final approval. So this is how you do the performance review, this section here and just click this button, then you'll be all set. If you have any questions, please reach out to HR. Thank you.